Have you ever found that you needed to create entirely new categories from list items spread out across already established categories in Workflowy? Here's an example. A couple of years back, I was getting ready to move from one apartment to another. That's quite a massive undertaking for anyone. I primarily wanted a list of to-dos. I wanted to know what was to become of every single item that I possessed. I needed to know whether I was going to leave plants behind, fix or paint an item before selling, donate or pack something up, etc. So was I to create a list of categories according to the actions I wanted to take? Or was I to create a list of items according to the room or the part of the house they were in? Hmm, decisions, decisions. I thought to myself, I'll have the best of both worlds, thank you. So I created a list of rooms like so. And then I created a mini tag index of the actions I wanted to take, like so. I then went through each part of the house systematically with my iPhone in hand and dictated all the contents of each room, including action tags for each and every item. I would dictate into my iPhone like this. Fan, hashtag donate. Yoga and sit-up mats, hashtag clean. Plastic chair, hashtag donate. And so it went. And once everything was said, it was time to get everything done. And to organize the doing, I constantly referred to my tag index. If I, for example, hit the disassemble tag, then I'd see a list of all the things I had to disassemble. And right here, I have a new context from items scattered across different categories or lists. In this case, different rooms of the apartment. Here's a list of the things I had to paint. A couple of things I was going to donate, etc. So this is how you get to create new categories from within categories that already exist. You decide how to set up your lists and then tags will do the rest. So in organizing your lists, don't think that you're stuck with one category or another. You get to have the best of both worlds with a little bit of forethought and some tag categories. You'll find a link in the description box to the exact list you see in this screencast.